What's up, y'all? Welcome to the Sand the Beard Guy channel. So today we are checking out the Max Richter uh, piano from SRM Sounds. I meant to record this last week, and then I had the freaking flu. So I'm um, a little behind on some of my video stuff. But uh, yeah, if you haven't checked out <clears throat> Max Richter's music, you know, <clears throat> very similar vibe to like an Oliver or whatever, neoclassical kind of thing. Um, pretty sure he's done some film work um i don't frequently listen to to max but i listened to it enough that when i saw this piano get referred uh to check out i was like oh that could be cool so um yeah this is a uh, i got this loaded up in native instruments um real easy to install and pull up uh real simple so um let's Dig into this stuff as always. Like, share, comment, sub, all the things. My Patreon is live if you want to help support that. Um, but yeah, let's just dig into this thing. So it comes with two pianos, closed and open. Shouldn't have to explain that. <clears throat> so uh, let's do the closed. Um, the closed uh, and the open have the same kind of UI here. So you just have a vintage ribbon mic, um, a modern valve, and an ambient, and then some reverb, noise, um, <clears throat> sensitivity for your velocity. That's it. So real basic, real bare bones. Uh, and then uh, you have your round robin over here um, if you want to have that engaged. So yeah, let's just play a little bit of the closed. Um, I don't think any of these parameters need any explanation. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. So this is just loaded in as is. I haven't tweaked anything or changed anything.
Yeah, it's got a, got a really unique feel to it. Um, you know, as you get higher up, it gets rolled off or it feels rolled off. And so uh, this is definitely not like a bread and butter, I would use this for everything type of sound. This is very unique. Yeah, so if we take like the modern valve and the ambient out. Yeah, so it's just a very unique, very unique specific sound, which when you think about, um, you know, if you've listened to his music, this this is, you know, kind of a, a sound. Um, so, uh, yeah, real basic, you know, this is one of those pianos, real basic bare bones um, settings. Let me reload this and let me have some fun with the noise a little bit, you know. kind of hear that in there. <coughs> yeah, so it does sound nice. Um, again, it's just really unique. Um, very, very tucked, a very mellow piano like it has no um there's no aggressive dynamics to it it's it, it almost feels like it's cc values 80 and below you know which again is fine um that's just kind of what it feels like so this is the open piano uh vintage modern ribbon and pencil same settings so it's uh yeah Thank you. 
actually like the open quite a bit more. Um, it just feels just getting a little bit more of the piano sound, which of course that's the whole point of open versus closed, but it's already so mellow and so tucked that I like having the open sound just just a tiny bit of it you know uh, let's try see what these mics sound like Yeah, so that is the Max, you know, Richter. There's not a ton to talk about feature-wise because it just has a lot of them. Um, actually, I don't know if y'all could see these labels down here this whole time, but they are here. Um, so, yeah, I mean, this is definitely one of those, like, unique, niched pianos. You know, would you use this in a worship set or use this in a... Um, you know, a, a jazz gig? No. Um, but if you're needing a super, like, tucked, gentle piano, um, then this is <clears throat> this is a fine piano. Um, I enjoyed playing it. Uh, I'm glad y'all recommended it, because a few times it got recommended. And usually, when something gets recommended once, I'm like, okay, you know, because there's 15 million pianos. But if I see something pop up, multiple times. I'm like, okay, cool. Uh, maybe I should check this out. So uh, I'm glad they sent this to me. I'm glad to have it in the arsenal. Um, I can definitely see myself using this. Um, it's just so nuanced and niche um, that, you know, I, I probably use it for 5% of the stuff I work on. Um, but I think that's kind of what they're going for here. This is not a catch-all piano. Um, this is a, a very specific sound for a specific genre um but yeah max richter y'all if you haven't checked out his music it's great um it's worth listening to so thank y'all for watching as always make sure to like sub share comment all the things and i will see y'all later